A quick funny look at complete idiocy. Norwegian naval frigate officer crashes ship into an oil tanker and sinks it. And I do believe that we have rotten, rotten politics, and I'm, I'm not using that as an exaggeration. <laughs> Now, this was a duty commander of a Norwegian Navy frigate which sank after colliding with an oil tanker and he's been found guilty now by a court in Norway of negligence. The officer had been on duty, and this is the funny part, for eight minutes (laughs) on November the 8th, 2008. So it was some time ago, but the vessel was a 442-foot KNM Helge Ingstad. And it collided with a Maltese flagged oil tanker, the Solar TS. And what it actually did was ripped a hole in the side of the frigate and it sank. <laughs> Eight minutes in. <laughs> What's he done? <laughs> Woke up and just sort of sod it. It'd be all right, we'll just go this way. <laughs> I'm not even bothered looking. Could he be drunk? I mean, it doesn't give you why he managed to, <laughs> to crash into an oil tanker in a frigate. It doesn't give any explanation on that at all, unfortunately. But it does highlight the fact (laughs) that he was only in charge for eight minutes. Do you think the captain saw that they were going to crash and thought, I know, (laughs) I know, where's the duty commander? (laughs) It's your turn. (laughs) I think it's more than likely the second version, don't you? If you can think of any other reason why a vessel that's supposed to have all of this detection equipment on board, like a frigate, would be able to hit something like an oil tanker. Unless it was all by design and this guy's a patsy. You never know nowadays, do you? But then that'd just be a conspiracy, wouldn't it? (laughs) Now, this duty commander is the only person to uh, actually be prosecuted as well. So all of the people that were on watch at the same time, you know, like the radar watcher and stuff like that, though it's not them, it's just the guy that was in charge. So I actually think it's probably the more than likely the captain saw what was going to happen and thought, yeah, I'll, I'll get out of this one. Dave, 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 come and take over a minute, mate, while I go for a slash. <laughs> Absolute joke, but it's funny, isn't it? How much did that cost? <laughs> now, thankfully, all of the crew were unharmed, apart from... A couple that were slightly injured, eight out of 137. So no harm, no foul other than monetarily and embarrassment and possibly jail time for the duty commander. Let me know what you think, though. I think it's proof that we're not picking from the best, are we, anymore when it comes to protecting ourselves and arming the military. We're not doing any of that anymore, and this is more proof that we're not up for the job anymore. Let me know what you think, though. Stay sane. See you on the next one.